Kagyu Sami Ling is a Tibetan Buddhist centre. The site was an old country house in the Scottish borders. It's being made into a rare thing, a modern Buddhist garden. The name comes from Sami Gompa, the monastery from which Tibetan Buddhism spread after the 8th century. It's 150 kilometres south of Lhasa, where the more famous Potala was built in the 17th century. At Sami Ling in Scotland, eight stupas flank the entrance wall. They commemorate the eight stupas in which the Buddha's ashes were placed when he attained Nirvana. The stupa walk leads to Johnston House and to a wish tree. It has the Scots name, Clutie Tree, meaning cloth tree, because wish trees are both a Scots and a Tibetan tradition. As the cloth fades, the individual's wish becomes the world's wish. The Peace Garden at Sami Ling has a large stupa, prayer flags and a pool. This stupa commemorates the Buddha's victory over a serious illness, so it's called the Victory Stupa. The flags carry prayers for compassion and world peace. Their colours symbolise the five natural elements – earth, wind, fire, water and space. As the wind blows, the prayer flags carry blessings in all directions. The pond is round and the statue commemorates Nagarjuna, a great philosopher. His ideas of dependent origination and emptiness explain that nothing we see is independent. Everything is interconnected. Man and nature are inseparable. In legend, these ideas were entrusted to the Nagas for safekeeping. Nagas are snakes and they love water. So there is a Naga house in the River Esk at the junction with another river. The Liberation Gate is a formal entrance to the monastery and to the Tara Garden. It has Buddhist symbols on its roof, a Dharma wheel and deer. In Tibetan Buddhism, Tara is the main female bodhisattva. She has 21 emanations, represented in the Tara Healing Garden by a lotus with 21 petals. The petals are defined with curved stone walls and planted with herbs. The blue Mechanopsis poppy in this bed can be used as an anti-inflammatory in Tibetan medicine. Tara symbolizes the unending compassion of a goddess who labors day and night to relieve suffering. She was born amidst Avalo Kiteshvara's tears. He wept at the world's suffering, and his tears formed a lake in which a lotus grew. Tara came from its bud. A statue of Avalo Kiteshvara stands in the vegetable garden, and there are peacocks among the vegetables. South of Sami Ling Garden is a hill with prayer flags and mementos. It's a good use for an old coniferous woodland. Imagine the direction I've got for you. Great, sir. You get a salute now. <laughs> I know. I know.